afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. We are here in Wroclaw. Did I say it right? <laughs> it's a hard one. It's our second time here. This time we're joined by a lovely couple, Adam and Sonia. We've met for the first time yesterday and we're just, it's really great to be They've here They've taken them. us into their house, fed us, bathed us. No, I'm just kidding. But uh, <laughs> today is uh, Polish Independence Day. Uh, it's crazy, like the city is packed, Polish flags everywhere. Everywhere, yeah. The, there's going to be a parade and it's just really cool to be here and actually see it and show you guys what Independence Day is like here in Wrocław. With real life Polish people. <laughs> <laughs> this is the lovely couple we've been talking about here. This is Adam and Sonia. Adam, uh, I met uh, through the comments actually about a year ago in our Warsaw video. We've been talking like ever since and he's taught me a lot about filming. I owe a lot to this guy. He's a very good guy. And this is his lovely girlfriend. Hi. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> So it's cool. It's cool to be in um, in Wrocław here and and them tell us like things you know from the mouth of a Polish person like how things are and and what help the, us with our pronunciation. Yes, help us. <laughs> they, Wrocław. Wrocław. You gotta roll the R. It's kind of hard though. Wrocław. There are so many Polish legs here, and there's children. There's like even little ponies here. And the, I don't know, it, it's a really cool thing to, to see. We wouldn't have, I don't think we would have even known about this if it weren't for your comments. So I'm glad that we're here. If it weren't for us, you meant. <laughs> <laughs> Adam, why is there so many eagles? What's the eagle uh, mean in Poland? Uh, the eagle is a symbol of Poland. It's called Orzełek. And it's like an eagle in the... Is that what's on the flag? Oh no, there's no, no, the, no. The, the, the emblem, I mean. Yeah, the emblem, the yeah, emblem. like the, the, the logo. Flag, I don't know what's the word. We actually haven't experienced much rain in, in Poland at all, but today on uh, Independence Day, this is a shitty day. <laughs> it's actually... It's hailing. It's actually frozen. Oh yeah. It's hail or like snow? Hail. Oh, we gotta go. Well, guys, we're going up into the uh, Sky Tower. It's Is it the biggest tower in Poland? Uh, I guess so. We might think it is. We might think it is. It's hail! It's hailing! Ah. Without any warning We're sucking up the oxygen The room is getting smaller We always have it coming like animals who like to bite Tasting not disaster 20 something seconds go Guys, this is our apartment. We have moved into an Airbnb. Thank you, Adam, for letting us stay at your house. And Sonia, we had a great time with you guys. This Airbnb, we got here last night. The host was three hours late. Such and, a headache. And the door doesn't lock. <laughs> It was it's, a good night. It's never happened to us. We were pretty much stranded for a while, but in the end everything worked out. Since we're in the town square, I wanted to see if Wes could find this window that is close to the apartment where we're staying actually. And it's a window painted because it's made to look, it, it's meant to make the building look symmetrical. And so they painted a window, even though there is no window there, just so everything would look all lined up. And we're very close to it. And Wes- Do you know where it is? Yeah. It's, it's close to where, to our apartment actually, to our Airbnb. Oh, is that it right there? Yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. Maybe there are more, but I did read about one right at the main square and they painted it. <laughs> you can't tell at first glance, but you can kind of tell now when you're looking at it. So if you can't tell by my breath, it's four degrees today with a low of zero. So like winter is coming and it is here in Wrocław. 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 Oh. What? Well, Felicia has become the teacher. Well, not really. It's still hard, but I'm I'm trying to pick up certain things like what letters sound like, you know, like the W sounds like a V and the J sounds like a Y. So starting slowly, not be fluent yet. Be because we're gonna move to Poland. Surprise! We're having a baby too. Oh shit! <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Maybe. A pierogi baby. A baby of pierogi. Last year we were in Wrocław here. We were here and we did. The, we were like searching for these little dwarfs. Because in the city, all over the city, there's these dwarfs. Well, they're, they're little statues. They're yeah. little statues. All over the place. 
place. And it, it rep some of them, sometimes they're outside of like an ice cream shop. You'll see that it has a little ice cream cone. So they're like related to where they are. Or if it's outside of a bank, it'll be a little dwarf at an ATM. It's like the cutest thing. And someone sent us the backstory for it, but I, I forget to be honest. But there is a story as to why they're all over Wrocław. I always get like a smile. <laughs> it's like, oh, oh there's one. one. We haven't seen this one yet. I don't think locals care as much as we do. I know. Nobody <laughs> else is excited. <laughs> We're at some bridge, um, I guess that really doesn't matter what bridge we're at. We're meeting up with a uh, one of our viewers, a Polish viewer. So this girl, I have her on Snapchat, and she, she was like f recommending so many places to us. She would literally send like pages on Snapchat, pages. Of, of things to do, of what we should see, of recommendations, like crazy. Like a personal tour guide. As our plans were changing, she'd be like, oh, okay, I see you're going here now, let's do this. And it was just so nice, and I'm so glad that we're able to meet Inez. We actually did meet her yesterday, and we're waiting for her here today. She's funny, you'll see. I'm trying to create friction to warm up Wes's hands, because he gave me his gloves. Okay, go. And then if I go like this, his will warm up too. Because he needs his hands for the camera. Does it work? <laughs> yeah, this <Yeah>? one. <laughs> Life hacks with Phil. It really works. For the small price of $19.95, buy Felicia's gloves and you can do this too at home. Okay, guys, we have met up with Inez, our tour guide from Vatswav. Hi. <laughs> she's the cutest How thing good? and she's been so helpful. <laughs> How nice is she? How nice are you? Very <laughs> <I'm> nice. Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> so is she... Nicest, you know? <laughs> <laughs> she took us on a cable car. It's like a... Is it for the university students or...? Polytechnic students, you know. Yeah, oh, okay. it's called the Polinka. It's like it sounds a, like the Hungarian Palinka. <laughs> it's like a two minute ride. <laughs> That's fun. Now we're on the other side of the river and we're going to Centennial Hall. We made it to Centennial Hall and we're just walking down the pergola. It's beautiful, even though it's not green and flowery, it is still really nice. There's berries and it looks very like fall-like. And in the summer, this is where they have the big fountain sound and light show here, which we haven't seen yet, so I guess we have to come back to Wrocław. This is called Centennial Hall and uh, it was built in like, I don't know if it was 1913 or 1930, somewhere around there. But what I didn't even realize, I didn't even think about this, was this city, Wrocław, was actually a German city before. Um, so the Germans built this and like the architecture here, it's like all circle, all round. It's definitely a place to check out. Guys, we gotta be really quiet. We're, t we're chasing a guy in a cape. It's getting dark now and our lovely local guide, Inez, brought us to Cathedral Island, which is the oldest part of Wrocław and it's called Ostrów Tumski in uh, Polish and we got so lucky because we actually get to see a guy who comes around every night around this time to manually light all of the gas lamps and it's cool to see like a tradition that's gone on for so many years so we're kind of like following him around as he lights all the lamps so I think we've I think we've trapped him this lamp is the only one I can see that's left no, this whole no, this oh the whole street yeah oh, okay well no, no. but this one we're gonna get him here <laughs> We just packed, we're taking a train to the most recommended city since last year, since our first video, everyone has been recommending. Poznan is next. So um, I just want to say thank you to, to Inez. She was crazy good. Thank you so much. And also thank you to Adam, Adam. and Sonia for everything. We love meeting you guys. Yeah. And it's, it's a beautiful sunny day today. We don't get to vlog on the sunny okay, days. Okay, we gotta go though. Okay, yeah. adios amigos.
we will talk to you very soon. Thank you for watching.